Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm recording with the brand new Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus. It's a flagship phone from Xiaomi, come with Snapdragon 821 and 4GB of RAM. At the back we have two cameras, both cameras are 13 megapixel with an f2.0 aperture. We also got the front camera which is a 4 megapixel ultra pixel sensor, also comes with f2.0 aperture. At the moment I'm recording with the back camera, as you can see guys, I'm recording at full HD at 1080p at 30 frames per second. The phone cannot record at 60 FPS, it can only record up to a maximum of 30 frames per second like I said. So let's have a quick look and see how the video comes out. So first of all let's test uh, the auto focusing capabilities of the Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus. So let's bring it really close to the leaf and see if it can auto focus. There we go. I haven't yet tapped on the screen guys, as you can see it has focused on the leaf straight away. Uh, no, it wasn't straight away to be honest, it took a few seconds but still at least it was able to do so. Okay, so let's uh, move across a bit more. Let's go onto the left hand side here and see if we can focus on the leaves here without us doing anything at all to the phone. Okay, it takes a while, a couple of seconds as you can see. Obviously, the leaves are moving, it's a bit windy, that's why the phone is struggling to keep the focus. Let me see if I can tap on the screen and then we can get the focus in. Oops, 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 it's uh, too, it's a bit windy, so the phone is definitely struggling to focus. Okay, so let's move across and try something else. See how stable the video is. Now, as you can see, I'm walking, and the video seems stable enough, not too bad. Not the best, not the worst, but still uh, good enough, not too bad. Okay, so let's focus on the sleeve here then. Without tapping on the screen, give it a couple of seconds. Uh, just about, there we go, is able to do so. Unfortunately, every time I, do, I try to do so, <laughs> the leaves start to move because it's windy. Um, let's have a look here if we can focus some, on something different. There we go. And if focus is there, it takes about a few seconds, but eventually it's able to focus. Not too bad. Okay. For the budget, for the price, um, Xiaomi are not known for their cameras, as most of you watching know that already. Uh, they have just average or above average cameras, but obviously they need to work a lot on their uh, post processing algorithms. Uh, with the likes of, if they have to compete with the likes of Samsung, Sony, LG, HTC, all of them have improved in the last few years. But uh, Xiaomi are still obviously a new player in the market and uh, in, in the flagship segment they have been taking quite a few phones out in the last few years. But camera department definitely needs working from what I can see so far. Uh, the colors are not as sharp from what I can see. Um, a bit on the dull side and uh, the contrast ratio seems to be okay not too bad video is a little bit shaky when I move across and you can see the blur motion here is unable to cope up with my fast movements from left to right or right to left so like I said uh, this definitely needs a bit of improvement but for the casual user out there for your social media needs I think it's not looking too bad okay so I will try recording a, f a sample from the front camera as well guys so let's stop this now and switch on to the front camera Okay, so now I'm recording with the front camera on the Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus. It has a 4 megapixel ultra pixel sensor. Uh, it is the same sensor which has often been used in HTC flagship devices. As you can see, it's daytime. It's not sunny. Uh, the conditions are darker and difficult. So I don't know how the video footage is coming up because I'm obviously looking at the camera directly. I don't want to look elsewhere, otherwise I'm going to look funny. So I thought I'll look at the camera, record the footage, and I'm sure once it's up on the PC, then me and you, both of us, all of us, sorry, in fact, can look at the footage and see how the footage is coming out. Um, not looking too bad. I'm trying to move across from right to left and left to right and see how it goes. Let's walk along a bit and see if we get a stable enough video. There we go. There's no selfie stick guys, I'm holding the phone with my hand, so uh, obviously um, you will see a bit of movement in there as well. But this sensor seems to be, of little bit I've seen so far on the screen, seems to be producing colors a bit better than the sensor at the back. As you just saw in the same footage before, when I was shooting with the back cameras, the colors were not as accurate and the video wasn't as stable, but the front sensor seems to be doing a bit better uh, than the back sensors at the back, the two cameras that we got at the back of the phone. So not looking too bad. Let's change the angle a bit and see how the exposure comes in. There we go. Sky. And then back onto my face. So not looking too bad. So guys, that's me recording with the Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus uh, with the front facing camera. And you've also seen the footage from the back cameras as well. If you like my video guys, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comment section. And like always, uh, please subscribe as it helps. And I shall see you in the next video.